Hey guys, so today I have a Petra solution to show you. Um, this is a solution from earlier this year that I did for the cubers.io contest. Um, this was before I learned any DR or anything like that. This is just what I did. Um, and this is just a nice, pretty elegant Petra solution. So here we go. Uh, first step, two by two by two. I did the green, yellow, red, because we have, we have a lot of blocks all, all over the place for this one. So I did that to line up these to connect to here, which also connects our edge there. So we'll connect them, make our square, and solve our first block. And then we have this pair and this edge, which are which we can line up like this. Um, but before we do that, I actually did this half turn to connect this pair and connect this edge. So then we make our square and solve our two by two by three. And then we have two bad edges here and I fix them, fix them in a way that uh, preserves this pair. So I flip them like that. And now we have this kind of uh, multi-slot case where we can insert this pair and set up this one to be really short. So we go like this and then that move cancels into that. And then we have this OLL with a Z perm, which is a pretty easy um, two gen case to remember. Um, all you do is you take this pair out in the back and then you do an anti soon and then you put the pair back in. And uh, with that last layer, we also had some moves cancel. So if you look at our solution here, the B prime cancels completely with the B here and then the U prime and the U prime add together to be um, U2. So that's 14 minus three, so 30 move solution which by today's standards, 30 moves isn't that great, but for just the default Petra solution, that's, that, that's pretty good. So yeah, just a nice easy Petra solution today. So thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.